Royal shock, Duchess of Cornwall makes worrying confession, I'm ashamed. Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall has had to adapt to living without seeing her loved ones throughout the coronavirus crisis much like the rest of the UK. However, it seems she wasn't so into keeping in touch in the non-traditional way. Many Britons were quick to embrace video chat and messaging as the new way of keeping in touch with their loved ones during lockdown. However, Camilla wasn't so quick to adapt making it harder for her to communicate with her nearest and dearest. Camilla said, I'm ashamed to say that I really hated the internet. I didn't understand it and thought, what's the point of this? However, she soon overcame her fears and got back in touch with her loved ones. Camilla added, since lockdown, it's been so brilliant because I've been able to communicate with family, my children, my friends. Moreover, it seems that Camilla has gotten used to a more relaxed personal dress code during lockdown. She also revealed that she loves wearing jeans and that it will be very hard to get out of them again. I think you get into a sort of way of life, don't you? The Duchess of Cornwall will appear on The Emma Barnett Show this week as a guest editor. On the show, Camilla will discuss life during the COVID-19 lockdown as well as her family, her work-from-home style and her charity work. Camilla has given a pre-recorded interview discussing Prince Charles' health following his coronavirus diagnosis in March. He is probably the fittest man of his age I know. He'll walk and walk and walk. He's like a mountain goat, he leaves everybody miles behind. Prince Charles has now recovered from COVID-19 but says he is still experiencing a loss of taste and smell. Camilla underwent a period of self-isolation at Burke Hall, away from Prince Charles, and emerged without symptoms of COVID-19. The Duchess of Cornwall will also talk about being able to hug her grandchildren again. You're so excited because you haven't seen them for three and a half months. Your first reaction is to run up and hug them, and you have to sort of put up your hands. It's a very odd feeling, she says. Camilla will also discuss her work with Safe Lives, and has long championed raising awareness about domestic violence. The Royal will also share some tragic stories she has come across during her charity work. Camilla is set to discuss how she once heard the horrific story of a man murdering his wife with a hammer, and how it spurred her to get involved with the charity. I don't think any of us could believe what we were hearing. I could feel the tears starting to drip down my face, Camilla will say. It was so moving and so horrific that afterwards, I met her mother, a grandmother who had to take in charge of the children. I just remember saying to her that I don't know what I can do, but if there's anything, I promise you, I'll try and find a way. That's really how it began. <laughs>